Hi, it's the Mobile Home Diva coming at you with another tour. This home is humongous. This is the Spartan, y'all. This is the Spartan, number 18. The Spartan, I'm at Wayne Fire Homes in Byron, Georgia. This home center sells live oak homes. Won't find any prices. You'll have to call them for pricing. They're not allowed to post them. But they have some absolutely beautiful homes here. And I can't wait to see what the Spartan looks like. Again, this is the Spartan at Wayne Fryer Homes. So let's go in, shall we? And see what we have here. All right. Love it. Love it, love it. All right, we just entered from there. I can see a nice entry table there under that mirror. Really nice, love the cutouts. See the dirt on those rugs? That's exactly what I'm going through at my house. That's why I love these cutouts because your shoes would be there. All right, awesome family, I love that. So this is the living room. Nice open concept, looking into the dining room and kitchen. Great space in the living room. You could do a lot over here. You could put your TV on that wall. You could also put your TV on this wall if you like, or you can make this an entry, put an entry table here to greet your guests, place for keys. Um, sit your purse down, lean your umbrella against, take your shoes off, etc. All right, so this is the living room. The living room opens up into opens into this beautiful kitchen. I love it. You got your little nook over there. You can put your coffee station over there on one of those sections. You've got a cute little island in the middle, like a prep station. It doesn't have a place for a stool. I might would change that out and get a different island, just one that has an overhang so I could put a stool, but you've got great cabinet space in there. I love the quality of these cabinets. Very nice. I always like to, I try to remember, sometimes I forget, <laughs> to open a cabinet just so you can see. You got a window over your double sink. Very nice. You got outlets here in the island in case you put the blender or the juicer or the pressure cooker on the island you can plug it up and you've got space over your cabinets if you want to put decor I know I mention that all the time but I'm always thinking about how I'm going to decorate my space you've got a nice size utility room in here really nice this is huge so you've got you can put a desk over there. You can put uh, shelving for a pantry. You can put all kinds of things over there. Deep freezer. Your washer and dryer will go on that wall. And there's your back door. First time I've seen a back door that doesn't have the windows. But you know, you could always trade that out if you prefer one with windows. Very nice. Huge laundry room. Probably taken away from the kitchen. The kitchen could be bigger with all that space. So very good. From the kitchen, that's your view into the living room. So if I'm here at the sink, I can see what's going on in the living room as well as the dining room and the family room. You've got a nice size table here in the dining room. So six people could sit there comfortably right off the kitchen. Very nice. And the hardwood extends from the kitchen into the dining room. And then off the dining room, you've got this great little family room space um, that your family can hang out. If you don't have a TV in the living room, you can have one on this side. And just have one area for the family to like just do things as a family you know you have your living room space over here for company and then you could have your family room space or people could spread out right if you've got company 
everybody could talk to each other in the living room, the kitchen, the dining room, and the family room. Very nice. I'll go back over here and let you take a look. I also like how they decorate it. It just feels homey in here. Very good. All right, so your guest bedrooms are back here. You've got your, we came to the guest bathroom first. It's got a sink, just one sink, mirror, tub, toilet, shower combination. There is guest bedroom number one. It's your guest bedroom and closet. That swoosh, you guys, is my backpack <laughs> going down the wall. I got too close to the wall. I got a backpack on with all my camera supplies. You've got guest bedroom number two. Nice size guest bedroom. Looks like it might have a walk-in closet. All right, guest bedroom here, guest bedroom closet, number two, huge guest bedroom, and then you've got a third guest bedroom over here. It's also a really nice size room. Awesome. Really nice with another huge closet. Very nice. So three guest bedrooms in this one. I forgot the name, let me get my list. What is the name of this one? Y'all remember? Somebody keep me honest. I'm looking at my list. The Spartan. This is the Spartan. Let's see what the Spartan's master looks like. They just have this decorated so nicely. It just looks like home. I love it. And that's a good thing about viewing these homes because you could get an idea what they would look like. Ooh, huge, huge. Master looks like there's a sitting room area in here. Very nice. Very nice, Master. So you walk into a sitting room, right? So you could have some comfortable chairs or, or not. It could be an office. It could be um, a makeup room. It could be an extended closet. Whatever you like, I personally would have a sitting area over there. And since my headboard would be on this wall, as I'm laying in bed, my TV would be on that wall. So we could either sit in the sitting room or we could lay in bed and look at the TV. So this is just the bedroom area. Or this whole thing could be a bedroom. It's really up to you. You could put your headboard there and make this whole room a bedroom but this is a great size I haven't seen a master this huge in any of these homes since I've been touring so awesome oh yeah one other home had a huge um master with a sitting room all right master bedroom has two sinks huge sinks Got a nice mirror over the sinks. Love the uh, cabinet colors. Very nice. You got a garden tub. There's that tub I like that my neck fits in so nicely. Love it. The toilet sits next to it. These tubs are deep. Love them. Love them, love them, love them. You also have your shower here and it has a bench. Very nice. And then your master closet with a door is in here. Very nice. They, all, they forgot the shelving on this wall and that wall, but that's an easy fix.
before they roll this baby off the lot, they could put that on for you. You just gotta request it and then add it to your bill. Very good. A lot of times I get questions about how much do I have to pay out of pocket for this, that, and the other. None of this would be out of pocket. Um, well, I take that back because I got blinds added to all of my windows and I paid for that out of pocket. Um, but then there were some other features that they just added to the cost of the home. So it just really depends on the home center, but they will work with you. Just talk to them. So very good. Huge master clock, master bedroom. Love it. Again, you have your living room that opens up into your kitchen, dining room, and family room. And this is a four bedroom, two bath home. It's called the Spartan. It's a 28 by 76 at Wayne Fryer Homes. Thanks for watching. Just looking through the skyline